The idea here is to convert some of these wood pallets into some French cleat hangers for my downspout gutters. The original build had six slats on each side, but I changed that to only three slats per side, which made it simpler to make while reducing the overall size of the frame. Then I went ahead and cut one side of the pallet slat at a 45 degree angle with my table saw to create my French cleat. This 45 degree angle will be what the wood boxes will hang on to. I went ahead and drove a couple of drywall screws through the wood slats and sandwiched them around the a half inch steel conduit. Another benefit was the wood frame made the steel conduit frame in my garden box a lot more rigid. So let's take a closer look at the wood boxes. As you can see, I have attached a small one and a half inch strip of wood which is cut at a 45 degree angle. I used some one and a quarter staples to attach the strip and also in the assembly of the boxes. The staples make assembly quite fast and also will hold the box together over time. You can also see that I left a gap on the piece of wood I used for the bottom, so water will just fall through it and not collect in the bottom. So let's go ahead and see how easy it is to attach the wood box to the French cleat on the garden box. You can see how easy it is for me to hang the downspout box to the matching 45 degree cut angle on the garden box. And this type of hanger is very strong and durable. These French cleats will allow me to experiment and test some different ideas by allowing me to move the boxes around to different parts of the garden that receive different amounts of light. This station is under my patio and is shaded with partial light, but I reckon this would be a perfect spot for my lettuce, especially in the heat of the summer. I will definitely be doing a comparison of the lettuce in the downspout versus the lettuce in the garden box and see what the size difference is. This experiment is still a work in progress, but you can get an idea of the different stations I have made so far. As the downspout boxes all face the sun at completely different angles, so it should be interesting to see how each location works out. So stay tuned for part 2 of the French cleat system as it is an experiment in progress, as I will let you know what worked and what failed. And as always, keep on growing, and always explore and manifest your ideas into the world as everyone will benefit from your shared experience. So until next time, see ya!